here's a little look at my first couple of days back in the UK, which were kind of taxing because I had a cold, but I did get to eat some of my favourite food and walk my mum's dog. So that was pretty good. Here we go, look at all the sausages. Yeah! <laughs> Way better than Japanese sausages. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's enough of me showing off to my Japanese partner that I'm getting to eat British sausages, which may or may not have looked appealing in those pictures, but they were delicious. I had a lovely time and it was just what I needed. Unfortunately, it didn't make me well quick enough, but it did help. Actually, I was back at my mum's place for quite a lot of the time I was back in the UK because I had to sort out all of my stuff. So people really didn't realise how many boring things I had to do when I was in the UK. And it was a lot of lifting, big heavy things, and also getting to have a look through some of my cool stuff. But in a way that was really heartbreaking because I had to give lots of it away to charity shops, some of it to friends, but I really didn't have the luxury of time or a travelling ability to be able to do that successfully. Anyway, I still got to have a little walk around the local streets and see some of the street art and graffiti and see how that had enhanced the area, actually. And there we might think about the difference between street art and graffiti. I don't know. Both can be good. Both can be bad. And I stocked up on all kinds of berries and things like radishes and large cucumbers that I can't get when I'm in Japan. And it really was great. I got my fill and none of the things were as expensive as people were implying they might be but I think that's because in the supermarkets in Japan things are actually quite pricey anyway. You might not think so at the current exchange rate but honestly they are. I got to see ducklings and I walked the dog a couple of times even Thank while I was feeling watching. rough. Check anyway, out more coming up soon. forward slash Miss Kendall James to support me and see what else I make.